Thank you, Senators and Representatives, for holding this hearing. I've been here before. I've been working hard for with you for more than 10 years on health care reform. And while I'm happy to have the opportunity to be here again, I look forward to the day when um, we don't have to. I am not going to talk to you um, about my experiences as a nurse in Vermont for 30 years in um, trauma, general surgery, psychiatry, med surgeon, currently in cardiology at our level one trauma center in Burlington, Vermont. I'm not going to talk to you about the heartbreaking situations, the heartbreaking stories of patients that me and my colleagues see every day. Um, I'm not going to talk to you about what you already know, that primary care um, in the emergency room is a thing and it shouldn't be. It's very expensive and as my friend and neighbor Abby just described, um, it kills people when people wait um, to go see, seek health care um, until it's too late. What I want to talk about is the, the context that we find ourselves in now. Um, and I remember saying in times before when I testified that now, now is the time. This is the moment. This is the political moment. And, and yet, um, I feel that way even more so now when we are getting the um, fire, fire hose of attacks from DC, when our governor here in Vermont wants to cut um, educator positions, when our government in Ver governor in Vermont and others are talking about a for-profit prison system. Um, that's a huge concern to me. When our property taxes are going up and up and up, um, and largely because of the cost of health care, of paying into health insurance. So John Muir um, is known to have said something like um, when you try to pluck something or pull on something in um, somewhere, you'll find that it's connected to um, everything in the universe. And I feel the same way about this issue, um, just as I mentioned, property taxes, education, health care um, is impact, the cost of health care is impacting all of this. And in the environment when we're all being impacted, uh, many more so than others, by the horrific policies coming out of DC right now, um, now more than ever is the time for Vermont to do the right thing and move towards universal publicly funded health care.